Some much needed relief when it comes to travel. United Airlines is introducing a new policy to make it easier and cheaper to fly with your family. Now the cheaper part I get, sitting next to my family, there were days I will tell you I regret. Dan Bowens, you know, you know, Dan Bowens, you have four kids. I had two, but one of them was like having a hundred for you know, me. It's, it's an interesting, it's an interesting strategy here. Do you want them to change the rules or maybe you're like, I'm well, not so sure. I'm on I the fence about, about I this. I don't like this rule a little <laughs> bit, but you know, for a lot of people, it does cost a good portion of money and it can be very frustrating, especially when you have those little kids when they get older and they're teenagers, maybe you want, you know, you want to separate. But the Biden administration is now getting ready to crack down on airlines that charge more for families to sit together. So United Airlines is already coming out with a new policy that it claims will make it easier for families to do just that. It will be free. The airline will ensure that children under 12 years old can sit next to at least one adult in their traveling party. United will even open up preferred seats toward the front of the plane to avoid separating families. That's the plan for now, at least on paper, how it will go in practice, we will see. There will be no added fee attached to this. United previously warned families with children not to book their cheaper basic fares, which come without free seat assignments. So then you'd have to go in, you'd have to select that, you'd end up paying more. Parents who worried about being separated from their children were encouraged to pay that extra nine to fifteen dollars a ticket to select a seat or upgraded to a standard economy fare with free seat selection. Well, they're trying to change all that, and this change will begin next month for standard and basic economy tickets. Again, this is all through United. We haven't heard from any of the other airlines yet, but we know the Biden administration will be taking a closer look at all these policies, so there could be some uniform changes. Looks like United want to get out ahead of the game. United also not charging customers a different fare if they switch to a different flight to the same destination with seats next to each other. Rosanna, though, I think I may have cracked the code on this one. You just got to keep having more kids. Then nobody wants to sit next to you anyway. It doesn't matter, <laughs> doesn't matter where you go on the plane. You know, you got four or five kids. You see us coming. Everybody just clears right out. I hear you. I have to say, <laughs> when my kids were younger, I had one. I'm not going to call them out. One who would sit there and read a book the entire time. Wow. The yes. other one, I was up and down every aisle. Everybody knew my name. And a, a, there's this always that child's one. Name. There's always that one that gets away. You got to walk the yeah. there's, I, I'm totally on, on the same page. <laughs> <with Santa. laughs> anyway, good memories. Uh, thanks, Dan. Yeah.